me, TK, my man Has. Has, how you doing? What's going on, TK? It's so good to be back commentating Ultimate with you, of course. It's going to be a good time here in Worcester, Massachusetts. we got a hell of a top four coming up here. you got to think about it too, TK. We're going to start on the winner side of things. It's going to be Zamba going up against Cosmos. This is a... Uh, like a baby summit qualifier because yeah. you know the loser is going to have to go through either light or tweak and losers and then win two sets of who off of whoever wins so it's going to be an easier road travel but both these players with some great wins under their belt so far cosmos getting wins on some of new jersey's finest in jackal and tweak on the way here including a reverse 3-0 on tweak and also zamba getting some w's along the way on light uh and it's someone else really good. Oh, XL. XL's Wario. So I thought you were just going to leave it at like, and, and, and get some Ws. What else? Like, just the, <laughs> some big dubs, yeah. Zomba yeah. got some yeah. Ws. Okay, you know, Zomba's yeah, yeah. always got some dubs, man. <laughs> Trying to get one more right here. All right, but yeah, this is going to be a pretty good uh, scrap. I mean, uh, if you've been watching this tournament, you saw, I mean, this is definitely a little bit of a heartbreaker set uh, between uh, Cosmos and Tweak. Yeah. Where he definitely almost, uh, like, had the waft, but the game said, no, you actually did it. And now Bro. Cosmos is sitting pretty here at the top. Uh, but... He will be going up against a very hard opponent. That is Zamba, who is good at always reading what you're going to do off the lay, uh, off the stage. Like that man knows how to make you jump and then immediately snipe that jump. For sure. I mean, we've been talking about a lot of top robs recently, TK. Especially, hold on, up B. I was gonna say, I think that's gonna do it. Even on Rob fully connecting, Cosmos firing back, but. Talk about Zombo a little bit. We talk about Anathema, you know, having a great performance last weekend. I think, like, when we talk about top robs, Zombo has one of the best advantage states in Ultimate Period and of the robs, one of the best for sure. One of the best edge guarders, cleanest, like, uh, patience off stage. Side B, too, some of the best side Bs in the business. He's a menace off stage, trying to show that off here against the Aegis of Cosmos. We're going to see that a lot, TK. I like, yeah, I like that high recovery, though. You don't really get to see too much. I f almost all the time I see Photon and Stone's recovery, I'm like, that guy's dead. But, <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> but no, for this That's time it. around, he actually gets the chance to make it up back to the stage. Still, though, not really uh, being able to add anything up onto the second stop. Finally gets two hits, but I mean, just 18 to this 106. Really got a lot to make up for. Yeah, and I got to say, too, Zamba, not just a monster on the offensive side, but offensive, too. You're seeing Cosmos. I mean, oh, up smash. That's what I'm talking about. The conversions, TK. The jab lock right into an up smash. Very clean. Whole stock lead, but we saw how fast Cosmos responded in the first stock, see if he could do it again. I think it's probably the other scarier part too is that like, yeah, Cosmos really can't go out there and try to make anything happen as far yeah. as the edge guard against Rob. Rob is just gonna go high and you most likely cannot get all the way up there at least without using up B and uh, that's just not safe. Not, yeah. really, not really a safe option to be going for. Nice Ooh. turnaround with the uh, lightning buster though, but hold on. Flipping it around right there, such a good conversion, but now getting off the ledge. Nice, okay, leaning in with the Nair, tries to cross up, but Cosmos ready for it. Cosmos playing well, but still hasn't tied it up with the stocks yet, TK. Almost. Ooh, cool. Yeah, very close on that one. And yeah, that's the Cosmos special, man. Those, drift, those drifting up airs. He's going to be yeah. able to find those drifting up airs, some up tilts every now and then. Doesn't get the grab a little uh, late on the reaction for that, but okay. I thought we were going to see an up smash, but going for the up air, trying to juggle a little bit. Zamba now. Oh, what an air dodge. That was so good. Got a little punish off that as well. Mm -hmm. Usually, I feel like a lot of those times, you know, they get stuck uh, around the sword, but no, he's able to get in there, get himself a slight punish. Is looking close to taking this game, just has to find that last Rob confirmed. That, and there's three or four of them he can look for right now. But Ooh. oh, all right, there it is, the Cosmos Drift. That's that's it right yeah. there, man. My man's Tokyo with it. <laughs> but, <laughs> The Fast and Furious, you know? Well, actually, interrupting the Zombear, too. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. He said Zomb... Oh, no, see ya. No, I'm, I'm off that. Yeah, <laughs> we're done with that. Okay, hopefully, though, he can definitely uh, still get this stock and maybe make a crazy comeback, but, I mean, it's Zomba, and I don't really feel like Zomba's going <laughs> to give this game up just chasing <laughs> him down. The chase down? Yeah. Oh. He heard us say Fast and Furious. He's like, all right, bet. I hit the Nas. Here we go. Spacing it out, though. A little gyro play here. Holding down center stage. Dangerous position, too. The max rage on Zamba. Certainly a good hit will do it, but good spacing for Cosmos. Actually punishing the down tilt from Rob. It talks about how damn good that move is, and it is. But if you're ready for it, you got the spacing that Cosmos oh. does, uh, you're going to, well, see ya. Either way. Yeah. Try to build a whole comeback arc, you know what I'm saying? Then you just get side beat by Rob. I got nothing left to say. Yeah. That's it. The game is over. I mean, like, as soon as I saw the jump get sniped with the forward air, I was like, yeah, this, this, I, I know you, I know you're going to make it back to the ledge, but some just told me that this game is over. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> It was so much of a deficit to make up in that second stock, right? Like, Cosmos was able to fire back in the first stock super quick. But again, I mean, you're playing against Zamba. He's so good, specifically in this exact position. Like, at the ledge, like, if he doesn't go off an edge guard, you getting around his ledge traps is just so, it's so difficult. He's, like, surgical with it. Yeah. When Zamba's playing on it, it looks impossible to play against him. All right. So, Zamba, yeah, I mean, uh, it's... It's definitely not out the realm of Cosmos to uh, get back in here. I mean, honestly, Cosmos actually had to make a couple of reverse 3-0s, uh, if I'm not True. mistaken, in this tournament alone. So, you know, maybe he needs a little time to adjust. But as of right now, I mean, very solid first game here from Zamba. You know, he's doing exactly what you, you expect Zamba to do. Okay, just grabbing their way out of there. Zamba getting the turnaround. Your jump is gone? Okay, never mind. I was Dude. like, don't be like that. Not that quickly. <laughs> 
Nice. Oh, I thought you'd do the Lightning Buster, but either way, getting to the other side is important. Interrupting with the up air, though. Zamba says, get out of my face. Back throw, the pressure. Oh, get out of it. They're both swinging at each other. Get yeah. out of my face. I mean, look, that's what you kind of have to do, especially against Zamba. I mean, because he is going to yeah. always get that, like, back throw forward air, back throw top. So you got to make sure you can get uh, away from that at some point in time. Oh, oh no, you're not God. running away from me, though. I mean, obviously, that was that was very obvious. I mean, like, every, everyone does that, right? <laughs> yeah. Like, I, I, throw the, I throw the sword. Wait, it didn't hit. I'm rolling in. Like, that was like, that side B was the most broken move in the game for a week, and it's no longer that week. You know what I'm saying? Like that week is over, like a year ago. But it's still, it's still like if you don't know how to deal with it, it's tricky, dude. The thing, Pyra Mithra, well, especially Mithra, her up B hitting through the stage like halfway to the the platform is insane. Oh, the charge up smash though, Cosmos. We talk about his comeback factor at this tournament. Could be happening again here. Yeah, I'm super smart right there from Cosmos, realizing like, all right, man, you're gonna either air dodge and get to tech the stage or, or this platform. Uh, and I could have definitely tried to go for like an air dodge out, and that would have saved him. But most people are just like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna attack. Yeah. I see a platform, I'm gonna attack, and then immediately you just get, uh, get destroyed for it. However, though, speaking of destroyed, this man's Ooh. Cosmo stock not looking that great right now. Talk about his drift, though. You see him barely avoid that there. That was really nice. Expended to jump, but still made it back. Cleans up, but like you said, just going high. Which way do you want to try to land on Pyro? You don't want to give him the edge. You don't want to give him the ledge trap situation. You want to try to land around it, but the up smash, good punish right there again for Zamba. He's looking unstoppable today, TK. Yeah, I mean, he is continuously finding these uh, these up smashes. No jump uh, being taken there yet, but, I mean, if, again, he keeps threatening that same situation where if Cosmos uh, does end up panic jumping, is getting sniped. And speaking of sniped, this spike right there. Oh, I think boy. he's dead. He's gone. There's no way. Oh, all right. Uh, uh, hold on. All right, hold on. Down there. Oh, he missed the you, rare. That is super I rare. I feel like he saved him. I don't think he, he would have made it the first time. I was just saying, man. I mean, magnet hands do be magnet hands. I was going to say, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would have swung, too. Like, <laughs> she got the magnets, too, big time. You know what I mean? She's like Mario with him. Oh, man. Yeah, well, either way, he's still got a lot of damage here uh, as far as, you know, maybe not oh, okay, finishing okay, the edge guard. Okay. Wow, just fell right into it. That's the thing. He's like, Zombo, like, you look at the whole kit of Rob, you know what I mean? Especially off stage and at the ledge, too. Down tilt, forward air, you know, anything like that. And then you mix in the side B, too, which is multi-hit. It lingers for so long. Zombo just does such a good time, has such a good, does such a good job of mixing up the timing of what he's going to use and the moves that mix up the tempo of it, too. So, really nice job there from Zombo. Two, uh, I'm he's looking unstoppable yeah, today. He is, yeah, I mean, this this guy, he said, I'm getting the summit. That's that's what I'm, that's the type of gameplay I see right now. <laughs> like, yeah. I am, I am well, definitely getting the summit. You know so. what they say, you can reverse 3-0 tweak, you can reverse 3-0 Zamba. That is possible. But, Put it out there. It is possible. It is definitely possible. possible, but I mean, this might be the end of his run if he can't figure out something right now. This is the winner's finals, though, so he still does have some uh, time in this tournament. Uh, yeah. It just might be the end of his uh, his winner's bracket life because, yeah, Zamba is playing like uh, like this is pools to him or something. I don't know. Like, <laughs> it's, I'm, it's so dominant, right? And when Zamba plays this well, he does look unstoppable. But doing well recently again, too. Obviously, here at Shine, one of his best runs he's ever put together. Beating Light is, you know, one of his best wins of all time for sure. Just going here again. Cosmos has turned to talk. Good delay right there. Still getting caught. He's running a little low on fuel. Okay, so yeah, going sky high for it yet again. Yeah, have to get down to that ground at some point in time. Hasn't really touched the ground that long either, so. But now it should have a full fuel back. But either way. I mean, a, a way better start here for Cosmos. It actually does have a slight lead. It seems like he's trying to slow it down a little bit. Uh, but it's just, I think that's not really his issue right now. I think it's just where Zamba gets him past 100. He always seems to be able to efficiently take a stock. Mm -hmm. and that, was like a, that was a big thing I saw uh, actually early in this tournament. There was a lot of people who were at racking up damage, but they just could not get that person like off that stock until like 170, 180. Yeah. And that starts to add up. That Definitely. really starts to add up. Big time. And then, the, dude, in the rage factor too, like you can just reversal that stock. Mm -hmm. You have so much damage on you. And I think it's like... A combination of people having better survival DI, better ways of landing and mix-ups and avoiding win conditions. Like it's just so important in this game. Well, it's important in every game, obviously. But yeah. in Ultimate, as we get better at it, you're gonna you're gonna see a difference in the tier list, I think, as we move on forward. People can't find those kills. You don't find kills, you can't find games. You can't find games, you can't find sets, you can't find sets, you can't find summit. <laughs> True. <laughs> can't plant the flag at the top of the hill <laughs> if you're not finding sets right now. Oh. Either way. I meant literal summit, not not metaphorical summit. Uh, I, you, I meant the place. Uh, I mean, hey, listen, bro. I, <laughs> a literal summit is actually the – no, anyway. Like, <laughs> <laughs> right, we'll talk about it later. We'll talk about our, it later. Our poetry classes after this. We'll go free form. All right. But this, oh, is, yeah, this is not looking great. Again, nice. for Cobb was getting caught at the top. No jump yet again. All right. Oh. And, okay, oh, very I love close. That. I like the idea, though. Zombear? Dude, dude, it just doesn't matter. It no, doesn't matter. He, he always has the right answer. You know what I mean? This is looking like a quick 30 and a handshake. This is, oh, never mind. I was kidding, Cosmos. I didn't mean it. Tied it right back up. Pyra forward smash. Equalize. Oh, I was okay. That was, a, <laughs> right. that was a little bit of a reach. But, I mean, you're at zero, so it's not like you're going to die to what a. Uh, right. uh, 
a myth or a spike. She didn't have one. So. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> You're not exactly worried, yeah. All right. See what he can do, though. As he's, he just wants to, he just needs to start off by getting a game. You know, you, you get the game as as a you know has <laughs> eloquently said. You get the game, you get the yeah. set. You, you ever get look the at set, a bracket? Some. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. A bar sometimes, man. Feeling myself here in Worcester. Here we go. <laughs> Who is Throw it? that out there? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, man. Go to the park. <laughs> it's too lit. Honestly, trying to land here. Dash attack carving through. Ooh. A couple forward airs. Looking for the pressure now here. Cosmo's playing at a good tempo, though. Yeah, yeah. I, I think, yeah, he's definitely, you know, he stopped kind of jumping into Zamba, which is a, a, a real big thing that um, Zamba was doing a good job of uh, dealing with. Now, he jumped into him right there, but at least it was a safe jump in. Uh, mm. But more often than not, I feel like, yeah, Zamba would get uh, at least one stray hit. He was turning it into a lot, and sometimes those stray hits were just coming off of Cosmo's trying to approach. So Cosmo's right. managing to slide past Ooh. that back air, but, uh-oh. Oh! All oh. right, he still has a jump, but, oh, oh. okay. That's a good stall, and I, I mean, I really like the idea from both sides. Zamba looking for the high recovery, but, you know, Cosmos knowing exactly how much he can drift. He could get this game F-tilt. Yeah, I mean, down tilt, up air could potentially work at this point. Might be too much rage going high. Juggle situation. What's Cosmos going to do again? So good with those up airs usually, but Zamba down GGs. throw. Oh, with the last hit. Oh, okay. living, though. Living. All right, good. Yeah, really good DI on that one, man. He get, got as far to the right as he could. Oh, Okay. I know we don't say it anymore, but that was definitely a tomahawk. Like, yeah, oh, we like, say, oh, I'll say it. I'll throw it out there, you know what I mean? All right. Go to the skies again. It's been working out so well for Zomba. One of the strongest attributes and one of the strongest strengths of this character, Pyramithra. Ledge trapping, edge guarding, all that good stuff, but just deleting it. Looking for the Zomba there. Barely avoiding it, though. Cosmos? Cosmos, a little slice. Oh, <gasps> Try okay. to roll through it again, like the first time. Oh, Cosmos, are we? Oh. There's no way. There's no way he could do another reverse 3-0. Actually, he definitely can. He's on the road to do it. 1-2 right now for Cosmos, putting himself on the board. I was actually real super surprised that like he went for that dash attack right there because I was like, I mean, Zamba has shown that like I'm going to jump him back here. Yeah. So, yeah, that dash attack, you know, probably could have got him blown up if, if Zamba's doing the right thing, or even if he just neutralated there. But, you know, didn't lose the stock for it, didn't lose his life for it, and then ends up getting the game. So, yeah. I mean, not sure if we're going to get the full – uh, reverse 3 0, but it is possible. It is definitely possible. It definitely, yeah. This is the way this is the way it starts, right? And I think, too, like that blazing end, we've seen Zamba deal with it by rolling through it earlier, too. But I think he got caught at the ledge, so the last couple hits hit him instead. It was, I don't want to say a risky one because it worked out for Cosmos, mm -hmm. but I'm saying it's risky because Zamba knows how to deal with it. You know what right. I'm saying? But either way, here, game four starting up. Cosmos picking up some momentum. 37 on the board. That's when he started doing really well against Tweak, actually. He's like the conversions into upbeat, like just letting him rip right there. More yeah. Mithra, more juggling right here. But either way, Zamba's fadeaways are just so good. Mixing up with Nair, air dodge, whatever he can do. I like that he, he, he didn't get greedy on that first uh, one, too, because, like, you know, he probably could have tried to do a fast fall land into another back air, but he's like, you know, I'm just going to take the damage. So let me just go ahead and get this 30 something real quick. However, he's off the stage now. We have very early recovery. Zamba probably expecting a little bit of a stall out this time around, too. But now, uh, Cosmos has been really good at tricking up his recoveries as far as how he's getting back to the stage. He's only really been sniped out of uh, or having to resort to using uh, Photon Edge once so far. Right. So, yeah. All right, Blazer. Oh. Potentially cleaning up the stock now. Setting up the gyro. Good movement, though. The fastball was clean from Cosmos. He's cleaning up the recoveries a lot. Like, he's learning for sure. As you have to against Zomba, you're going to drop stocks super fast, as we saw in the first two games. Ooh, over the let. He is so tricky, too, at, at his recoveries. I mean, that was, that was just ballsy. Ooh. Oh, okay. okay. He gave it up. He gave yeah, it up. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he's done. Yeah. Well, sometimes you, you, sometimes you just got to give it up, you know? <laughs> like. I'll, I'll, I'll say. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. So this man's uh, 122 right now. Doesn't Ooh. mean he can't get the stock off. Yeah, that's the Zomba. Bro, I, I love the grappler stuff from Zomba. Like, oh, you're going this way. Nope, you're going this way. All right. Just toss you around like Zangief, you know? Yeah, he doesn't always do like the more, like the I'm just doing, you know, uh, up throw until whatever. It's always something. Every now and then he's like, I just want stage control. Yeah. I want stage positioning. So he'll do the back throw or the forward throw into something real quick. And just got to get you off stage. And try to get that jump out. Good back air there from Cosmos as he gets himself. Back into this game, only at 66%. Not really a lot to be, uh, you know, looking at as far as damage goes. And he's got the stage control as well. Hold up. Yeah. He Ooh. kept the stage control by grabbing the nice. gyro, too. That was really good control in the matchup specifically. But here we go. Cosmos with a lead all of a sudden. I'm telling you. There it is again. I'm telling you, TK. Those upbees, that's really when you saw the momentum shift uh, in his previous set. So we're going to see if he can do it here against Zamba as well. Man, back-to-back 3-0s. -back Cosmos is working on it right now. Still has a long road to go, but he's looking good so far in this game. Four. Nope, not enough. Okay. If he's, if, he's, if he's able to do that, man, Cosmos is one of the Ooh. craziest characters to watch. I mean, like players to watch because he is a yeah, character. He he is a character for sure. <laughs> but like, he will end up getting like 
triple three stocks and then still the win with a set. You're like, the resilience on this man is insane. <laughs> like, how does he do it? How do you keep yourself composed? But True. we may not see it. It is possible still the 156 here on Tazamba, which means, Ooh. okay, I was going to say, which means a forward uh, tilt will work, but the down air works just as well. Yeah, dunking him right down. You saw Zamba likes to go over the ledge just a little bit, hopping over it, trying to peek over it, but the down air, it's so, that hitbox is so big. So nice job capitalizing there by Cosmos, but suddenly like this, Potentially in his last stock right here on winter side, but the offense has been so real for Mithra. We could see more come out from Cosmos, but he's got to find a hit first, DK, or grab. This is good. Oh, turn around, too. That was so good. The offense from Cosmos is nice right now. Ooh. Okay. So I'm actually looking for a, a, a opening right there. Could not find one. However, finds one right here with the jab, pushing him off the stage. What can he do to keep that positioning? Oh, no, it swapped up. All right, he's going to make it back to the stage, though. Okay. Falling through here, getting a grab on the back air. Following up. Oh, pirate time. Hold on. This is where Cosmos wins sets, potentially okay. win this game. Yeah, it is definitely possible. Cosmos, I mean, like, Ooh. this is a, a last stock, last hit situation for sure. 103 to 102. Who's going to find that uh, last big hit? Cosmos going back to the Mithra. Okay. Yeah, he wants to win neutral. You know what I mean? He wants to feel comfortable. He's got to get out of there. You do get foresight as a defensive, too, as Mithra. But here we go. Pirate time. Oh my, he just does it? Are he, you serious? He that was not even just close. Yeah, he like, just <laughs> <laughs> that was the most Nike back air I've ever seen. Like, I'm just going to do it. Yeah. <laughs> actually <laughs> swooshed in yeah, with yeah. it. <laughs> All right. It's, I mean, like, honestly, Cosmos. it's a really good move. So. Cosmos, just do it. It doesn't matter. Hold on, yeah. The back air, too. Look at this. Man, look at that. Okay, that is, I call Bowser's forward air and everywhere. You know, it's E air, it hits up, it hits down all around. Actually, Pirate and Mithra have like three E airs, you know what I'm saying? That's one of them too. Yeah. Boom. Well, I, I feel like the, the funniest is, part was yeah. uh, how how often, or like at the very beginning of this game, how often we all confused now, down air and back air. Because they look exactly the same, so now you just have to read it off the uh, knockback. You're like, all right, right. Yeah. <laughs> that was back air knockback, for sure, yeah. Yeah, sure, yeah, they're all the same thing, <laughs> yeah. They have different angles like uh, Kazuya, you know what I mean? Oh, you got back man. tilt, you got back down tilt, it's her, but it's all like the same move, you know what I'm saying? But either way here, we got a game five situation, TK. Early start here for Zamba, but Cosmos up. Reverse 3 0 Fiend today? Is that what we're seeing? I'm I, I was, look, I mean, I don't know. I don't know if he ever has actually been a triple or uh, double uh, three stock, but I mean, he will lose some games like kind of handily in those first two and somehow nice. bring it back. He's done it once, he's done it again. And I mean, if he. <laughs> man, might even win the Ooh, tournament like this. Oh, what? <laughs> That's a stock. Do you see that too? It's he's activated, bro. It, it, yeah, Cosmos. It has been activated. <laughs> yeah. Sir? Sir? It has been activated. But the thing is, like, dude, that started off of a parry off of a Rob Neutral Air. Tried to cross up Cosmos or not, like it was ambiguous, and he just neutral air. Like, it just covered both sides. It's so smart. Why wouldn't you just do that? It works. Ooh. Nice. This is okay, man. I, uh, another situation where Cosmos, I mean, again, you know, I said he was activated, but he, he could continue to find more levels in this activation. Yeah. It's not a button, you know, it's a knob. You know, you turn yeah, it yeah. higher. Like, he's at like eight right now, and he's about to be in a nine very quick. Oh, okay. I was going to say, actually, never mind. Dial yeah. it back down. Oh, yeah, I was about to dial <laughs> it back down. Back, back to a six on that one. But. Can't even hear it. Turn it up. But here we go. Looking for something nice, waiting for the air dodge. Lightning Buster almost KOing. Man, a Mithra KO would have been huge right there. Cosmos has been good in this position throughout the rest of the set. Forward to two stock lead for Cosmos in I, game five. I, I don't know why he threw his hands up. You got punished. Like, like he outspaced your he outspaced your get up attack with an F tilt. And he's like, that hit? <laughs> that kills? <laughs> It's one of my favorite. Yes, F tilt definitely kills, bro. <laughs> Back air crossing up though. Look at the spacing again from Cosmos. Look at the movement. Get a grab. Oh, the oh my God. Turn around down tilt. Working on a three stock right now. Back air though. Zama's gonna make this comeback happen. All right. This is the way to do it. Oh, the drop. Oh, hold up. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Smart. Oh, what? I mean, that, that was cute. I mean, it didn't, it didn't lead anything, but that was very nice looking. Well, literally I said, stop it. Put my hands in the air like I don't care. You know what I mean? <laughs> literally did it. Threw him up. It's a field goal, it's good. Here we go. Oh my god. You know a player's feeling it when they start doing the gyro combos. Down oh. tilt up air. Shout out to MK Leo. Still living though, but just barely. But yeah, Zamba feels like he is he is lost out of steam. Well, out of, out of gas, I guess, if you're a raw player. But yeah, yeah. just not looking uh, great for him. You know, still could make some type of crazy coming. You've seen his edge guards. You've seen what he can do. He just has to get this stock off 
uh, without a, yeah. you know, while avoiding everything Pyra can do, basically. So, oh, hey, they are Mithra. Smash. Okay, yep. Okay. Up smash is gonna do it. Zamba taking a second right there and taking it in. That is the second reverse 3-0 that Cosmos has gotten in this top eight today. First one earlier against Tweak, and then again against Zamba, and it got TK like it progressively just went the other way for Cosmos. Like the momentum really swung for him in game three, got stronger in game four, and then game five. We really were looking down the barrel of almost a three stock, honestly. I feel well, like we have like to just suck. we have to just put away, do away with with choke mouse, bro. I think that's just gone. I oh think yeah, it's all it's, it's either Cosmos or not Clutch today. Most. Like he can heal, definitely he definitely can lose, but I think as of late, I've seen that man do nothing but clutch. So Clutch Most is really in the building right now. Yeah, big adaptation, and I think. Like, Pyramith is such a strong character, really, really rewards that adaptation. I mean, you look at the two different characters, how they can help you in two very different ways, too. Like, they're both so good, but just in very different ways. So, what's going on, chat? We got some great sets coming up to, uh, for you through the rest of this top four. You got me, Haz, and, of course, TK, my good friend, joined here today. We're going to have a great time. But the rest of the top four, Cosmos winners finals. Cosmos winners finals, man, which means Zamba will be sitting in losers waiting to see what happens between Light and Tweak. That's going to be a pretty uh, stellar set. But uh, for that Cosmos win, I got to get, yeah, big shouts to Marcus. It's too lit. It's too lit. It's too lit. I love Marcus, yeah. dude. He, he, whatever, man, he is like a soundboard. Like anything he says, it gets so catchy all the time. Yeah. It's too 